Hello there, it's uh, Francis here from Generational Wealth Academy. Now, on today's video, I am going to be going through how to install an auto trader, you know, otherwise known as um, an expert advisor, which is an EA, or um, also known as a robot. Now, in, you know, for this particular, for the purpose of this particular video, I am going to be use my, using my own auto trader you know called the supremo or um, also known as the precision trader now you know to do that we would simply uh, go to the top left hand corner here you know and click on the the, the file tab then we'll go to open data folder And, and that would bring up this um, this window. We then want to go to MQL4. Now, what we are looking to do here is basically to um, you know copy uh, the expert advisor folder here. You can see that's the expert advisor folder. is is called experts, but really it is the expert advisor folder. Now, if you were looking to um, install anything else you know say you know something like uh, the indicator or an indicator here is where you would in, you know install that but this is not an indicator but an auto trader so you would install it in the expert folder like so so you open that one up what you would then need to do you know once this opens up is to go to where wherever you have um, downloaded the expert advisor file or the auto trader file you will copy it and come place it in here now this like I say is the expert folder so you'll be going to perhaps it's going to be your download uh, folder you pick up the expert folder file which you have already downloaded and come and paste it in here you know I have it you know downloaded somewhere else you know so I'll just go there and pick it up from there now you can see what I'm doing here I'm basically you know placing them side by side except that um, this folder is refusing to move <laughs> I'm looking to move it to the left anyhow you know this is basically you know um, this is basically you know the, the the file I'm looking to paste onto here I can simply you know drag and drop it in here otherwise I copy and paste let me just drag and drop in drop it in here so I drag and drop it in here and you know obviously you know the transfer would take place and um, you know we would begin to uh, finalize the process of installation okay the computer seems to be playing up but I hope um, what we need to get done is taking place. So there you have it. I mean, we could now close this um, this window. We've basically copied it onto there. We can close that now. Now this is the expert advisor uh, folder. We now have it in there. Let me go show it to you somewhere else. As a matter of fact, we could close this as well. So you come back here, you come back there and click on view or rather place your cursor over the view and go to navigator. You want to, navi you want to open the navigator window. So that's the navigator window and this is basically where you have the exports folder. You have some files there already. You know, the file we've just added does not quite show yet because we need to refresh it. Now to make that happen, you will either have to close the whole of the MT4 and you know reopen it. Otherwise, just you know come under MT, uh, come under the expert advisor section here, right click, and refresh. You will see it come up when I click on refresh. And there we have it, GWA Supremo EA subs. Well, as you know, by the way, GWA stands for Generational Wealth Academy, you know, and the, the file is called Supremo or the auto trader is called Supremo. So what you now want to do 
is basically you know drag it onto the chart itself or double click let's just drag it drag it onto the chart and you will see what comes up now this is basically what you would get you know you will get you know um, this if you go to the commons tab there are the boxes you need to tick here and if you go to inputs you will see the let me just expand this you will basically see the settings for the supremo now let's go back to um, well we don't have to do that now but let's just go you know you're going to be coming back here later on to tick these boxes you know you want to have them ticked so everything here should be ticked except this one so if you go back to the input box this is basically where you're going to be um, adjusting the settings according to what we give you and that is where you're going to be you know placing your password now some expert advisors you know would come asking you for a password you know um, like ours if it's one that is free or if it's one you've bought somewhere else and it doesn't have uh, the need for a password then obviously you just um, you know adjust the settings and and run with it but ours if you're wanting to use ours it will ask you for a password and every single um, you know auto trader that we give you does have a license you know so does this one you know but anyway we're going to be coming here later on after you know when um, you've gotten the license so what you need to do now because even if you were to click on okay even if you were to adjust the settings and click on okay you can't actually use it because it's going to keep on asking you for the license because you need to come back to us with the license and we will then generate a password for you so what you need to do to actually get um, the password is to click on the OK button here. Just watch what happens. You click on the OK button there. OK, so it will basically come up with this message asking you to contact the vendor, which is us. You know it will ask you to supply you know um, your registration information which you have here so once you supply us with this you know uh, registration information or otherwise known as the license key we would then generate your password with this you know so you so you could actually you know begin to um you know use the auto trader so what we usually would recommend is that you take a screenshot of this information this box as a matter of instead of typing it out and sending it to us your line sense will be made up of your name in this case this is mine it will be made up of your name and the number which will be unique to you you know so it's one line sense per broker so if you are with a broker maybe you go away it will be one license for that if you're going to be with ic market to be another line sense and so forth or under another license so you would take a screen you will take a screenshot of this send it to us and we will generate your password for you now I'm going to pause this and um, actually generate a password you know for myself with this so that you can actually see the rest of the installation process so I'm going to pause this and um, I will continue shortly okay so we now have um, you know the the password so I would now come back here having received the password I'll come back here and drag it onto um, the chart you know basically I would then go on and paste the password in here as you can see the password is rather long you know so I recommend you copy and paste as opposed to trying to type it all out like this so you come you copy and paste it in there and then you will go choose the strategy because with the Supremo um, Auto Trader, there are four different entry strategies. Now, you know what um, most of my um, clients would want to start with is the Precision Trader Advanced. You know, the Precision Trader Advanced. You have four options there. Choose the Precision Trader Advanced, which is a scalping strategy because most people just want to begin to make money with it straight away. 
you know, um, the precision trader advanced basically takes trades for you, you know, um, multiple, well, a lot of trades, you know, um, you know, over a short period of time, you know, it basically enters lots of trades for you. So you would then, you know, go on and choose that and adjust the settings accordingly. Now I wouldn't be go I wouldn't be going over the settings we recommend you know just on this video it will take uh, a, quite a while I don't want this video to be too long you know but once you have um, gotten the 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 password you place it in there you know and then you can go on to choose or tick these boxes make sure these boxes are ticked this one which says allow live trading otherwise it would not you know take any trades for you you know you tick these two buttons as well so all three box, um, boxes are ticked here this is ticked ticked the only one that you leave unticked or unchecked is this one so you go back there you know and then um, obviously you would adjust the settings that according to what we give you and click on ok see what happens you click on ok and you can see it basically you know has uh, whoop okay i'm not quite sure what's wrong there let's go see ideally this should not come up but um let's go see what the matter is okay so there we go we've um, gotten the right password now it's been sorted and um, you know everything is okay now so you can see it right here at the top right hand corner it says GWA Supremo EA subs, you know, so you can tell that um, it has now been installed successfully. You know, you can see a sad face there, as opposed to well, the, 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 the face you have on there is a sad face as opposed to a smiling face or a smiley face. That is because you need to click on this auto trader here, and you see, you know, that will change from a sad face to a smiley face. So you click on here the auto trader is now on and you can see here it's got a smiley face so basically this is how you would install the auto trader i would recommend you then go and save it as a template so so that whenever you open any currency pair you basically just click on that particular name and it would um, you know save it for you or open it for you as that so what i'm going to do i'm going to save it as a template I'm going to save it as a template here. I'm going to call it, um, let's call it Supremo. Let's call it Supremo EA. There are other um, templates there, but we're adding an additional one to it. Click on save. Back there, you will see this time. So if you were to for it, you will find it there, Supremo. Now these are other auto traders or well, other templates as it were, but this is the auto trader um, template for Supremo. So you click on that. Now, if you were to open up a different chart, let's just open up a different chart. For instance, let's open up um, card JPY. You can see it looks like that, but you would go and choose the template for Supremo and you will see it looks different and that's obviously the supremo template each time you will simply look up here and you will see that yes it's there which shows that you are actually now um, on or use the supremo but like i say make sure this is on let's just click on this as well double click go to common make sure this is on as well so two things i need to be on the allow live trading has to be on and this has to be on for Supremo to work and enjoy the benefits. Now, just before we go, I don't I don't intend this video to be very long, but just before we go, let me show you some of the recent trades that Supremo has taken for us. Okay, so these are some of the recent trades that Supremo has taken for us. Today is um so, well, today is Monday morning now, Monday morning in the UK. And these were the trades taken by Supremo on Friday. You know, so you can see it's well, it was mainly a lot of wins. There was this loss there, but yes, we cannot win every trade. 
So if you want to um, try out Supremo for at least uh, a couple of weeks or perhaps even a month, feel free to contact us and we'll let you have it for free for one week. And if obviously it's um, okay with you, you can go on and subscribe to it. Okay now, hear from you soon. At the bottom of this video, you would have um,